What's up guys and welcome back to another video on my channel and today we are going back to the most realistic price prediction. This time we will do it for chilies and this price prediction is not made up. It is based on the historical data and if you didn't have seen any of my price predictions so far and if you are wondering right now what this excel sheet is meaning then don't worry I will explain that to you in detail but before we are getting started if you want to see more price predictions like that and also want to see crypto market analysis then make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to this channel because I put out a price prediction like that every week and market analysis on a daily basis and of course as always the first link in the video description is my patreon account that is the right address for you if you are tired of having no idea in which market stage we are in right now what you should do when to buy when to sell when it is time to cash in profits here you won't feel lost anymore on my patreon account i will give you real-time updates on all my portfolio and trading updates plus you will get access to my discord community where you can chat with all community members also including me so looking forward to see you guys there and now i would say let's go straight into the price prediction as i said this price prediction is based on historical data and that is what you can see right here so that are the market cycles in chilies that we had so far but you can also see that is not very much data but the cycles that we had so far i have listed right here i will give you the first one as example so in case you are not familiar with that and uh, the first one is uh, the low so that was on the 27th of september 2019 there we had you can see it right here market cap in millions so 14.7 million market cap in chilies that was a market share of 0.00 zero six eight eight four percent and the total market cap you can see it right here is also listed in millions so that are 213.551 billion and then we had the high that was the 4th of november 2019 there we had a market cap of 66.9 million and that was a market share of 0.0270 nine six percent and from this market share right here to this market share right here that is an increase of 293.62 percent the same thing is counting here for the total market cap so from this market cap to this market cap that is also an increase of 15.6 percent i will not read all of the numbers to you right now but if you want to go through them then feel free to pause the video and uh, check them out uh, I want just uh, out of this data, I want to try to figure out what potential market dominance could Chile's achieve in this bull market. And you know, I'm not sticking to one prediction. I am taking a basket of prediction and out of this basket, I'm taking the average price. And this right here, that is my basket. But you can already see one thing is marked red right here. But I will explain that in one minute. Let's start off right here with the uh, with the underperforming scenario. That is the last low in market dominance. Uh, you can also see that I have uh, I have done a chart. So you cannot just see that here in the numbers. You can also see that in a chart. So these numbers right here are in this chart so the blue bars is the market cap and the orange line is the market dominance of chilies then also of course here the total market cap in that same time period and here the 0.01 percent so the the uh, the the underperforming scenario would be that we go back to this one right here so to the 0.01 percent market dominance then we have the scenario that we would keep stable so no gr no growth no decrease in the market dominance just staying at 0.17 percent and then of course also here we have the continuation growth that we had since march 2020 and you can see the calculation right here so continuation growth since march 20 and from march to march uh, we had an increase of 836.79 percent and that dividing with 12 months that would mean we have 69.73 percent increase 
per month and that we are multiplying by 15 because 15 months is the average time point in my average year time window of the of the market peak but i will explain that to you in also one minute and when we are multiplying that by 15 then we would come to the result of 1045.99 percent and we are currently at 0.17 percent plus the 1045.99 percent increase that would lead us to a result of 1.95 percent so that is how i got to this conclusion right here and then also we have this one right here uh, that is the continuation growth that we had since january and you can see here the numbers are yeah, huge uh, from january to march that was an increase of 1423.96 percent in the market dominance dividing that with uh, by three and that would lead us to an increase in the market dominance of 474.65 percent and uh, that also times 15 that would lead us to 7119.8 uh yeah and that plus where we are currently at flow so the 0.17 percent and that would lead us to 12.27 percent market dominance but i will i will um say also something to this in the end of the video so i would say first let's jump to the supply that is this one right here so you can see here supply also listed in millions currently at 5.586 billion uh, i have uh, the average supply in my time window would be 5.8 billion uh, this number right here you can see that is rounded and that would be an increase of four percent and now as we have the yeah the predictions for the market dominance the supply of course we also need the total market um, estimation and that is this one right here you can see in a time window between the end of 2021 till the end of 2022 and the estimated total market cap is between the is between 10.45 trillion to 16.67 trillion and uh, that is also what i meant with the 15 months that i uh, that i mentioned before so the average uh, out of this time window is the time point in 15 months so that is why i multiplied that by 15 and uh, yeah that is of course also not made up right here that is uh, also based on historical data and if you want to know how i got to this conclusion right here then i will link you my very first price prediction that is about bitcoin and there you can see exactly how i got to this conclusion plus of course also you will get the most realistic price prediction for bitcoin and uh, yeah right now as we have the total market cap estimation we have the time window we have the market dominance in chilies and of course also the supply we can start calculating and that right here is the calculation you can see right here that is my basket of predictions that right here is uh, i have always listed uh, the the estimation in the market dominance once with the higher estimated market cap and once with the lower one and i will give you the first one as example again so that would be 0.01 percent market dominance in chilies so uh, the 0.01 percent out of the 16.67 trillion that would lead us to a market cap in chilies of 1.667 billion and that divided with the supply would lead us to a price of 29 pennies and yeah the same thing here is also counting as before if you want to go through all of the numbers then feel free to pause the video i will just give you the average price and uh, before we are getting to the average price i have to say that this one right here so the 12 percent i have not included in this in this average price prediction because you can see 12.27 percent market dominance that is of course possible but i think that is very unlikely because that would be this this growth right here that you can see that we would continue this growth and as i said that that is highly unlikely so that is very a very low probability so that i'm that is why i'm not including that i have also mentioned that in for example uh, avi the avi price prediction uh, we had something similar right there so that was also a coin that uh, that had a huge increase in the market dom dominance over the last time and uh, if we would also go with this prediction in avi we would had uh, 
I think the highest estimation was $100,000 for Avi, but I also said that is of course possible, but it is unlikely that this growth is sustainable and very likely we will have months where we go sideways in the market dominance and then we will not achieve this 12.27%. So the parabolic growth in the market dominance is unlikely. That is also why I've written that right here, unlikely. And also you can see that right here, average excluding the 12.27% in the market dominance. So we are taking the average out of these three predictions right here, but I have also listed the fourth in case you want to stick to that, but I'm not sticking to that. Uh, because parabolic growth in the most case is not sustainable and yeah so that is why i'm sticking to these threes and out of these three predictions the overall average in chilies uh, in the price would be 28 dollars and 12 cents with a market cap of 163.1 billion and a market share of 1.202 percent so that would be the average in chilies uh, out of the three predictions right here in case also you want to do your own price prediction i have also listed right here for you guys and uh, um, uh, how much chilies would be worth with 0.01 percent market dominance in also the the higher estimated market cap the lower one and the average you can see the prices right here so with 0.01 percent market dominance and the higher estimation one chilies would be worth yeah, 29 cents and in the end also i have done the charts for you guys so that is uh, so that you can also see that in a chart and not only in the numbers that would be the first scenario right here that is the underperforming scenario that we are going back to the low that we had in january to the 0.01 percent uh, that is this one right here then we have the the 0.17 percent market dominance so that would mean no change no decrease no increase in the market dominance that is this one right here then we have the 1.95 percent that is in case we would continue the growth that we had since march uh, you can see that would be a huge price increase uh, the market dominance and the market cap here is not even uh, visible and uh, yeah with the 12.27 percent i have doubled that right here so 12.27 percent right here that is yeah you can really not see anything before because that increase would be yeah very big but as i said it is unlikely that this parabolic growth is uh, sustainable and will last through this whole bull market then also of course in the end i have the total average price prediction and that is with the 1.2 two percent market dominance and that would be the price of this 28 dollars and 12 cents and if you have any questions to that video then feel free to write them down in the comments also if you have an own price prediction also feel free to write them down in the comments would be very curious what do you think about this guys and if this video was helpful then please leave a like subscribe to this channel so you won't miss out any future updates and as I said in the beginning of the video, the first link in the video description is my Patreon account. Definitely make sure to check that out. It is absolutely worth it. That's it for this video. See you in the next one. And as always, have a nice day.